Lift off. Release. Engine at full thrust. It was meant to be a critical dress rehearsal that included docking with the International Space Station. We see their Starliner continuing its plunge through the atmosphere. But the Boeing Starliner rocket is back on Earth. Ahead of schedule, yes, but there is an element of mission accomplished. You look at the landing, it was an absolute bullseye. Better than I think anybody anticipated. Um, and so that's good for the agency, it's good for Boeing, um, and it's good for the United States of America. Congratulations, Starliner. Congratulations, indeed. Boeing safely landed its unmanned spacecraft in the New Mexico desert Sunday, cutting short a test mission that should have lasted more than a week. Just two days ago, Starliner launched into space, bound for the space station with food and Christmas presents for the astronauts on board. But it never got there. One of the clocks was set wrong, so the trek had to be scrapped. That again was two days, one hour and 21 minutes into Starliner's historic orbital flight test. Despite the mid-trip mishap, the space rocket made a perfect landing, a highly challenging feat. Flawless flight back to Earth. NASA is taking the win. In fact, you could argue that some of the hardest parts of this mission have now been proven to be very, very capable. Um, and so that's, that's, all, that's all positive. We're getting some of our first images from inside the cabin of Starliner. Another subjective observation I'd say that, that we find very encouraging at Boeing is the vessel looks great. The ground crews, they're telling us there's hardly any charring, perfectly level on our airbags, and that bodes really well for reusability. There were hopes the mission would be a historic step in NASA's efforts to resume human spaceflight from U.S. soil. The agency is working with private companies like Boeing and SpaceX to get American astronauts on American rockets. The Starliner had no problems rocketing into space or coming back down to Earth. It was what happened in between where something went wrong. SpaceX founder Elon Musk tweeting words of support to Boeing, writing, Orbit is hard, and wishing the Boeing team well ahead of the landing. For City News, I'm Karen Seolin.